Topping our news here at 5 o'clock and in your 17 Crime Watch, the state's effort to take down crime here in the Central Valley, which features an aggressive partnership between the California Highway Patrol and Bakersfield Police Department, is showing early signs of success. But after the first joint one-day operation, the question now is... What happens next? 17's Michaela Armstrong joining us in studio with the details. Michaela. Jim, the governor's plan for this partnership was to slow crime. So far, early results show that is happening, making it easier for the union to continue. The joint partnership between Bakersfield Police and Highway Patrol to crack down on crime in Bakersfield seems to have landed a victory after the agency's one-day joint operation led to positive results, according to CHP officer Tomas Martinez. We're able to put more officers out there to be visibly present, so that way it can be some sort of a deterrent for a lot of people. According to Martinez, to date, the agencies have issued a total of 227 citations, made more than 200 arrest, including two felony arrests, more than 100 stolen vehicles were recovered, and more than 200 vehicles were stolen or impounded. Martinez says the one factor that helped was CHP helping BPD out in high crime areas, like around the Highway 99 and 58 interchange and East Bakersfield. A lot of times, most of the calls for service are on the east side of Bakersfield, but it does vary. Governor Newsom said the investment in Bakersfield was due to the county's high rates in violent and property crimes compared to statewide. Not all agree. Bakersfield has seen significant decreases in violent crime rates. Um, we saw a 30% decrease from 21 to 22 in homicides, a 30% decrease from that from 22 to 23 again. And having additional resources will help continue to move it in that positive trend. As for what's next for the partnership, both say taking down crime together. High visibility drives down crime and when you have focused attention on certain areas that crime is going to decrease. If it is very successful, I could, I could see how we could be, continue to do this. According to Martinez, future operations will be done as needed. Michaela Armstrong, 17 News.